Hey there guys, Adrian Drums here and sorry I haven't uploaded in a while. Um, I've been busy with college work and um, settling in so it's been a rather wild um, few months since September. Um, you'll have to give me a second on how many months I did. Five, I think. I'm fairly sure. I don't know. I can't remember. <laughs> I don't want to embarrass myself. <laughs> um, but yeah. It's been wild. I've had assignments to do, I've had, well, just general coursework to do, as many people have, obviously, because of schools and everyone moving up a year and so on and so forth. <laughs> I'm being awkward. Um, but yeah, that's been wild. I know Twitch has also come to a little bit of a halt. But that will return, don't you worry. Um, I have been streaming, so that's not the issue. It's just that I've not found the time to. And even though I've got this week to, I've got one assignment to, uh, to finish off and possibly start the other, but it doesn't need to be in for months yet, so I don't need to worry about that. I'm going to switch hands without turning off my phone because, you know, I've done that already while trying to film this, so... Yeah, I'm doing, I'm doing well at this. I'm doing great. Um, so I'm just going to recap, pretty much, uh, my 2020. And it, of course, hasn't been the greatest, like we were hoping. But it's been amazing, from my point of view, anyway. And <laughs> there's a lot of people I need to thank, and... Um... A lot of events that have happened I need to learn from and just take heed in, really. Yeah. And I keep forgetting to turn off my phone, so I'm going to, you know, just do that whilst I'm recording because I'm an idiot. There we go. <laughs> Sorry about that. Uh, yeah, as you can see, I'm at my nan's, so I've got crimbo, we've got crimbo decorations up. I've got a jacket on that I got for uh, Christmas. I was sat on the edge of a sofa so it looked a little dodgy. Uh, I'm gonna go to the kitchen just because I want to give you guys something to be entertained by whilst I'm talking because I know have you just put on a video and don't even watch but I don't really care because it just means that you're enjoying content. Well I hope you are. Anyway, here's <laughs> a ramble out of the way. I'm in the kitchen. There's Bertie. He's, he's not a happy bunny. He's not a happy so I'm going to start off with what happened each month for me, personally, and just, you know, see what you guys 2020 was like in the comments. Also, I just want to share this with you guys. I just want to share this at my nan's house. It's just... I don't know if it's backwards for you guys, but it says, if you sprinkle when you tinkle, be sweet and wipe the seat. It's the best thing in this house, so I'm going to just be wandering around for, like, a few minutes. Um, I don't know where to start. Well, we start in January, obviously, but in the house, I think I'm going to just go back and sit down, because then I can see if anyone comes home. Well, I say home, but it's in my mouth. Oh. There's a... Just a wall of me. By the way, I don't know, I don't know why my nan has this, to be fair. Um, I can't turn the camera orientation around so you have to bear with me as I figure out what year group each of these are. Uh, year five. Okay. Year five. Year six. Year six. Year seven. Year seven, I presume. And year ten. But that's a story for why I've got short hair. Anyway, you guys know that story anyway, so... I haven't changed much, have I? You can tell. Look. I ain't changed much. Apart from my hair length and the colour, but you know, and like person but never mind. I'm gonna sit down. So January. What did I do January? What happened in January? For me, this is not I'm not recapping everything because that's just not something I can do and it's not something I feel like it's not worth my well, not worth my well. I was gonna say not worth my time, but that's not wrong. That's wrong. I don't know why I was going. That's not wrong, but I'm just messing up my words here. But it's just not something that I can comprehend on my own. You know, I need you guys to 
look, yeah, be here to talk about it with me. So January, what place was I in in January? Well, I was still in high school. I was doing my mocks for GCSEs. Um, I was preparing for my ones in May and June, which was hectic. And at the time we knew of COVID, but I don't even know if I can talk about COVID without getting striked. So, you know, it's going to be interesting. But because of the virus, we didn't know what was going to happen. At that point, um, in myself, I was having a rough... I was in a rough patch that month. Well, I was in February as well, but that's to be talked about in a few minutes. And in January, I was pretty low with myself. I didn't really know what to do with myself. Not weirdly, you know, just putting that out there. But, like, I didn't know what place I was in. I was isolating myself in my room. Much practice for uh, quarantine, I know, but <laughs> I laugh back at it now. And At the time, it was weird. Well, not weird for me, but it was just strange for me to distance myself and not feel 100% with myself again um, but not as a, a dysphoria sort of thing just more of a I need to be better at this or I need to feel good about this but I'm gonna just you know shame myself for it if you will um, so that was pretty much a month of me not feeling great about myself. So, you know, that's uh, always, <laughs> always a good start is when you talk about being, feeling like you're lonely when you have so many people around you. But, you know, uh, February was, wasn't much better actually, honestly. This, like, we had, like, the Australian fires as well going on, so... I was worried for my aunt, but she lived far from the fires, so I'm happy she's okay. And my niece, uh, my niece, my cousin. I don't know why I said niece. Um, but yeah, another month of putting myself down and shaming myself for absolutely no reason, other than the fact that I'm just, I guess I was just bored of being on my own, I guess. I don't know how to word it because I knew I'm not, I knew I wasn't on my own, like I had people on Snapchat, Instagram, um, I could talk to people, like I got my best friend who's literally my big sister and could, I would do anything for, um, I don't know, it's just, when you know that you've got people around you, and I'm gonna get serious here for a minute, you know you've got people around you and you talk to them you still feel like you don't know anyone like you feel well I did anyway feel as if no one understood what you were going through and you had to figure for yourself why you were in such a bad state or why no one keep you happy on a day-to-day -day basis but that's not other people's chore like jobs that's not like that that's they don't know any better so it's not their fault you know just i don't know how to word it without making it into another video so i'm gonna do that <laughs> start 2021 in sad times but you know <laughs> anyways so just yeah yeah i guess i guess that's just a the how how I saw tw uh, February and January just utter loneliness with people around me. I don't know. I'll try and figure something out for another video. Um. Anyways, uh, February. Um. Not February. I just did February. March. Now this. This is where things start to get better, and I'm going to be honest on the channel. And if this person ends up watching the video. And then wants to complain through their friends to me, then they can go and do that because I just want to be honest with everyone. Sorry, I got stuck in the. Oh, I want UTI. Anyways, um, relationship began in March. That was 
awesome. I was very happy and things started to get a lot better for me personally anyway. Um, I, I'm going to say how it began. Uh, that's no. About March 9th, March 10th, I can't remember honestly, but around then I started talking to one of my high school friends again. Um, I'd watched a stream of him and his friend on GTA 5, I remember this. Um, he was trying to get a uh, bike in a digger, a digger bucket. I just want to make sure that you guys heard me pronounce that right, because I don't want to be crap for that. Digger bucket, if you guys didn't hear me the first two times. Um, yeah, we started talking after the stream. I really enjoyed the stream. I was trying not to laugh so much that my cheeks were hurting. And anyways day comes round where he asks and I say yes and it's great for the majority of the year and it's just one of those feelings where you're finally comfortable in your own self that you're like I'm going to share myself with someone else and hope that they in turn likes me for me as much as I do well not try not like in a like a well, not boastful way, you know, just like a hope. No, I don't, I'm not boastful way, just like a hopeful way, I guess. I don't know how to word it. Sorry if you're getting distracted by me in the top right here, just like staring into your soul. But yeah. Um, so yeah, that was amazing March. April, birthday, you know, that's always the best part of April. <laughs> and like sharing my birthday and his birthday together maybe it was on discord but it was fun and I felt happy so that was good I guess I don't know how to recap you know I'm just this is my first time doing a recap and I'm just you know rambling here trying to make a video um I met some amazing people in March actually going into April, really, um, and disc, um, not Discord, I just said Discord, Twitch, um, I joined Discord on the 26th of March, and I joined Twitch, I started streaming on the 28th or the 26th, I can't remember, but it was one of those two, and it was a great start of so many friendships for me, and so many amazing, like, community build-ups for me. I was in my element making new friends, talking to new people. Oh, well, that's basically the same thing, but like on a voice call or whatever you want to call it. Just being myself online with new friends was just the best. I could talk to anyone about anything and there'd always be someone who knew or understood and they could help, which I'd never felt outside of being online before. Well, I had with parents and all but and, and that's not the point I've like I don't know how to word it really but joining this year has led to some brilliant brilliant friendships and I hope that we can all stay connected whether it be online or in person because some of you I'd actually like to meet up with in a couple of years or just Whether the very odd chance that I do see you, he, like local, or I go out and see you guys, yeah. Anyways, uh, I guess from here I'd like to mention a few communities. I know I have before, many of times, and you're probably sick of me hearing, uh, telling you guys about it. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just really awkward today. Um, so yeah, I'd like to thank Warehouse Goblin. I'd like to thank Why the Average Nerd, CJ, um, Bamboo, Beast, I don't know why I said that weirdly, sorry Bams, much friendly love to you bud, uh, Mr. Miyagi, Tough Man obviously, Bad Kitty section, so many communities that I'm a part of and I'd like to thank but just don't have the words to say or like Ex like emotions to express positively to you guys it's just crazy how much you guys have welcomed me into your community even if it was through a relationship 
which is now ended. Yeah, just thank you. <laughs> I don't know, I'm awkward as all hell when it comes to talking. Um. Oh god, this video is getting long. Anyway, um, May. Nothing really exciting in May, I guess, that I can remember anyway. Um, it was either May or... And it was one of the next following months I got was asked to be a mod for Goblin, and that was amazing. To be brought even closer to the community, even though I'd been there for a couple of months. Um, well, it was my dad's 50th in May. That was, that was fun. I really enjoyed that. Uh, June. I can't remember what June was, to be fair. <laughs> oh yeah, m missing out on GCSEs and that. That was crazy for year 12s, I guess now, because of September. That was mad and everything going on was just too wild for me to comprehend back then. Um, I know you'll probably watch this and say what about chester zoo what about you guys did this together um yeah that's awesome that was really awesome i just <laughs> in a general like overall recap it's just i'm just pointing out overall things here i'm not being specific well i, I have been actually never mind ignore me <laughs> actually, don't ignore me please watch my video um June, well, July and August. Well, August I went on holiday. That was really fun. Glad to have a break and do, like, carry on talking to some parts of the community and just keeping up with everyone. That was great. Um, September, starting college, meeting all of my amazing new friends and uh, having a laugh <laughs> at lunch and on the unit. It's always a great time. Always. And then uh, October, spoopy month. Nothing too extreme. Well, I lost my bus pass, actually. That was funny. And I got offered lift home, so... And then we carried on having lift home. So that was fun. It's the best times ever, I tell you. Karaoke game is just perfect. Um, <laughs> November... What did I do last month, for God's sake? Uh, not much, to be fair. It was just one of those... I guess it was just college and assignments, really, for me. Um, Twitch and YouTube, like, dwindling. But, you know, nothing wrong with having a break. And, uh, yeah. Now we come to December, really, where, you know, Christmas and... Well, just the holidays, for those who don't celebrate. Um, Boxing Day. Not got a New Year's coming up, but that's just January. That's not December. Um, <laughs> I got a new laptop and then for Christmas I got a printer. So that's awesome. Um, I'm really happy with that. And, you know, I got a jacket and, you know, other few things. Hey, tell me what you guys got for Christmas in the comments. If YouTube will let you. Because I don't know why the algorithm is just stupid. Anyways. Uh, <laughs> yeah, December's been fun to say the least um got put in tier one for a while which was entertaining to say the least even though i was inside and got back into tier two so hopefully that was the half-assed recap <laughs> really because i just i'm not writing anything down i have nothing near me to like prompt me or like give me a list of what to say so i could have planned this and i could have been better about this but you know i just can't be up can't be asked. Oh, sorry about that. I had a brain freeze for a sec. Not brain freeze, just brain melt. Anyways, <laughs> that's been 2020 as a recap for me. Um, we hit affiliate this year for Twitch, which was absolutely amazing, and that's been a video of its own. I've done a hundred videos on the channel, which is another video of its own. I don't know. It's just so many overall community things that have happened like follower milestones for uh cj bams um wicked that's another person i should have mentioned earlier i'm sorry girl but wicked for sure c2 um so many people that are just amazing to me but yeah that's been my 2020 in a recap
that's been half asked. Um, yeah. So. <laughs> Good lord, I'm bad at YouTube. Who isn't? Who isn't when they're just like? Who isn't? <laughs> just who isn't? I don't know. Ah. Anyway, <laughs> here's, a, here's a bloopers thing for you. Anyways, that's been 2020 for me in a recap. I hope 2021 is better, or at least just as good, in my opinion, anyway. Um, and yeah, thanks for those who have put up with me, and who will continue to put up with me, and if you don't, then that's fine, I don't, I don't really mind. And yeah, I know, uh, thanks. <laughs> Thank you all so much, I really appreciate every single one of you, and I couldn't ask for better friends, or better people, just in general, in and yeah, thank you for this. I don't know, I'm just, I'm just really bad at filming. Anyways, thanks guys. See you guys in the next video.